Hey, this is Christine from School for Joy. Today's tapping sequence is on celebrating yourself. Um, if you are someone who is interested in personal development and given the fact that you're here, I'm gonna assume that you are, you may have a tendency to constantly be focusing on your next step. What, it, what else do you need to fix? What's your next thing to think about? And that's great. I, I am um, a big believer in you know continual growth as a person and expanding who we are. But it's also really important sometimes to just celebrate you right where you are, all of the work that you've already done, all of the work that you're planning to do, but just kind of celebrating the fact that you are enough right here, right now, um, and recognize that. So that is what our tapping is for today. So let's get started. I choose to celebrate myself today. I am celebrating me, all of me. And I choose to deeply and completely love and accept myself. Today, I'm celebrating me. I've put in a lot of really hard work to get to be where I am. And I'm recognizing that today. And I am celebrating it. And I choose to deeply and completely love and accept myself. Today, I'm celebrating me. I'm celebrating the fact that I am enough exactly as I am. I am celebrating the fact that right here and right now, all is well. And if I never do anything else again in personal growth, I am good. And I choose to deeply and completely love and accept myself. Okay, eyebrow point. I'm celebrating me today. I am recognizing all the work that I have done. I'm kind of amazing. I've worked really hard to get here. I've been really vulnerable with myself. I've dealt with a lot of difficult feelings. I've created healthy boundaries. I've made necessary changes. And here I am. Right here today. Perfectly imperfect. And I am celebrating that today. Sometimes I focus on my next steps. And I get a little bit obsessed with what I need to do next what I need to fix next. But today, I'm just going to sit still for a minute and acknowledge all of it. All of me. All of my strengths. All of my gifts. All of my talents and all that I have to offer the world. I'm celebrating me. And even though that might feel a little bit uncomfortable, a little bit like I'm bragging, I'm gonna do it anyway. Because when I can recognize my own gifts and talents, and feel really good about them, it helps me to recognize other people's gifts and talents and to help them recognize them too. Because we all have strengths. We all have amazing things to offer the world. And when we can come into the world from a place of strength and generosity and knowing our worth, 
that only good things happen. We spread love. We spread light. We spread kindness. And connection. And empathy. And hope. So today I choose to celebrate me. I choose to celebrate my gifts and everything I bring to the world. And I choose to celebrate all of the other people around me as well and all of their gifts and talents. Today is a day for celebration it is, a, it is a day for connection, a day for love, a day for light, a day for hope, a day for miracles. What miracles can I manifest today as I celebrate myself? I am totally open to anything the universe wants to send my way. I am celebrating me today. And I am celebrating all the ways that I can create more love and light in the world. Okay, take a deep breath and stop tapping. How does that feel? Hopefully you feel really good and it may feel a little bit uncomfortable to celebrate yourself because so often we feel like that's bragging, it's obnoxious, it's arrogant, um, and it's not. I mean, it depends on how you do it, but if you really believe and know your worth and what you can offer the world and come at that from a place of love and service, then that brings only good things into the world and you are also much better able to see those qualities in other people. So thank you for tapping with me today. Have an incredible day and I will see you soon. Bye.